Rosa! Go into the RFA is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. I mean, Queen Dahlia herself asked you to go. I don't know, Maya. I just... <gasps> Rosa, look! The royal singer face-off? And the winner gets to be the opening act for DJ's concert! Eee! I have to join this competition! Me? Are you kidding? Yes, you! I've heard you sing before, remember? I... I don't remember. I know you can sing. No one can change my mind. You're just hungry. Come on, let's go home. <laughs> I really think you need to replace your van, Rosa. <sighs> I know. But our shop is struggling. We don't have the money. Besides, I can always fix this old thing. Yeah, right. The Royals will be here any minute, and we're still stuck in the middle of the street. Do you know how to drive? No. Oh, it's easy. Just hold the steering wheel and turn it to where you want it to go. Easy for you to say. Oh, if only the wings upgrade was cheaper. Ugh, just go. Fine. Are you ready? Ready. Uh, it's not moving. You should push harder. That's what I'm trying to do. Ugh. Excuse me, but could you stop the noise? <gasps> uh, hi. I'm Maya, and this is my friend Rosa, who is not disturbed by your presence. <laughs> uh, ladies, I hate to say this, but you're kind of disturbing my peace. Oh, I'm so sorry, mister. It doesn't matter who I am. Oh, okay, mister, it doesn't matter who I am. Could you please help us? We've been trying to get away from this place since forever, and... Drive. Huh? I said, drive. Okay... Bring your friend with you. Rosa, let's go. I can't believe it! We're moving! Thank you, it doesn't matter. Huh? Where did he go? Rosa, let's go home. Adrian, hi! You're finally here! Where have you been? I was just... exploring. I don't want to know where you've explored. <laughs> Adrian, I was so worried that you were kidnapped! Hmm. I trust that your men will be there to save me. Oh, not just our soldiers. I'll also be here to help if that ever happens! Then there's nothing to worry about. I knew I could count on you, Pink. <laughs> hey, I'll look out for you too. I'd be dead if I had to wait for your help. You're always asleep. <laughs> you have to wake me up before you run away then. <laughs> <laughs> so, have you eaten yet, Adrian? I... I'm not that hungry. Oh, come on! You shouldn't skip meals, you know! I'll be here when you need me. You mean, when you're sleeping. What else is there to do? Oh, hello, Father. Your Majesty. Prince Adrian, how do you find our kingdom? I, uh, it's quite huge. Huge? Well, I suppose you could say that. And how about my princess, hmm? <coughs> Father, don't put Adrian in the spotlight. <laughs> Is it not my right to ask him? You flew in here with each other. I must protect you. Damien. <laughs> I was just teasing him. <sighs> Adrian, what King Damien meant was, you may tour the kingdom, provided you leave the palace with your guards. King Aiden entrusted you to us, and we value that trust. After all, our kingdoms have been allies for hundreds of years. Forgive me, your majesty. Ah! Where did I put it? Where'd you last see it? At the RFA. Oh, why don't we go back to the academy? Maybe we dropped it there. And if we get lucky, we'll see Mr. It Doesn't Matter Who I Am again. By the way, I secretly took his photo last night. What? Ooh, someone's interested. Uh, I'm not. 
Don't worry, I'll send it to you so that you can look at him before you sleep at night. Maya! So, should we go back to the academy? I don't think we'll still find it, even if we go back there. What if we do? A lot of people attended the ceremony. There's no way! This is the shop, your highness. What with this place? Yesterday was Prince Adrian, and now Prince Eric? You can wait out here. We don't want to scare them. Yes, your highness. But Rosa... <sighs> a miracle. What? A miracle! That's what we need to get back that check. And I've been waiting for a miracle since I was five, so I don't think that's going to happen. Hello? <gasps> Mr. It doesn't matter who I am? <laughs> I believe this is yours. Oh, my fairies, you found the check! Is it okay if I call you Mr. Miracle now? Huh? Um... Thank you, sir, for returning it. Rosabella and I are inducted to you, Mr. Miracle. It's nothing, really. Mr. Miracle? Mm hmm? Will you be attending the academy? You look like a royal. <laughs> you can say that. Rosa, did you hear that? You and Mr. Miracle could be classmates! Maya! You're joining the RFA? Uh... I'll see you at the academy then. Excuse me, but I have to leave now. So, do you want to go to the academy now? Everything's all set as far as I know. If only Her Majesty asked me to go too. But it's fine. They replaced my old phone anyway. <laughs> you should go, Rosa, for your mom. And for Mr. Miracle. <laughs> Bye! I'll call you often! Remember, Rosa, it's for mom. OMG, have you seen Dean J's banner? Oh, I already registered for an audition. What? No fair. <laughs> you can do this, Rosabella. Common alert! Ew, what's that lowlife doing in our school? She makes me want to throw up! Then, why don't we do something about her? Ori, if I could, I would have done so! It's all that commoner's fault. <gasps> Hank, you mean this is her majesty's doing? The audacity! Excuse me, could you help me find room 400? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, don't mind them. They're just being bratty. <laughs> Thanks. So, you need to find room 400? I was just about to go there. I guess we have the same class, huh? Yeah, I guess so. Great, I'll show you the way there. Just a heads up, I heard Professor Dynamite is a nightmare. <laughs> oh, by the way, I'm Emma. Rosabella. <laughs> wow, what a klutz! I have to avoid her if I want to survive here. Good morning, class. Welcome to your first day at Royal Fairy Academy. My name is Professor Dynamite, and I will be your teacher for this term. So, can anyone explain to me the purpose of this academy? Yes, Ori? The purpose of RFA is to see which royal is best. What? That doesn't make any sense. And don't worry, that's not true. The RFA is a learning experience. Precisely, Ori. What? what? The rest of Fairyland may have told you otherwise, but the RFA is where you'll see if you're truly worthy of being a royal. Which is exactly why today, we'll begin with the competition. Aww. For your first lesson, you will be doing Magic Bottle. Using only your magic, you must tip this bottle. How about you, Rosa? You don't have any powers. We'll begin now. Ah, Adrian!
so nice of you to finally join us. Huh? He got in here too? Since you're late, you can go beside the commoner. What did I miss? Wait, you? Wow, I didn't know the Academy accepted thieves. Who would steal from you? Are you trying to insult me? Nope, just stating facts. You two! Less flirting, more listening! Huh? I'm not flirting! Hmm, that wasn't what Prof D said. Uh, I should be talking to Adrian. That dirty florist shouldn't even look at him! Pink, your turn. Time's up. What? But how? It's a bottle! <laughs> This'll be a piece of cake. <laughs> Last is Rosabella. Professor, you want the commoner to do it? If we can't tip the bottle, how can she? I'll be old and wrinkly before she moves it. Then this shall be a test of patience. Uh, <gasps> it moved? In all my years of teaching, only one person has moved the bottle. Princess Belle. That was amazing. I didn't know commoners could be so strong. I wouldn't say strong. <laughs> Ooh, the Royal Singer? It's the latest thing for us royals since it's hosted at the Academy. I'd totally join, but I sound like an angry cat. D&J is all the rage here. He's so talented, so handsome. Oh my fairies. Why would they even think of auditioning? They wouldn't stand a chance at the face-off. It's like, ugh. It's open for everyone, Ori. It would be boring if only Pink entered the competition. Oh, you're so brilliant, Eric. Hey, good luck. Hmm, do I need to know something? Huh? N no What are we talking about again? Anyway, you should totally audition. The prize money isn't much for us royals, but I'm sure it'll be a big help for you. Prize money? Mm-hmm. A million fairy dollars, to be exact. I could replace the van with that much! Why don't we sign up for fun? The contestants will be masked, after all. No one will ever know which one is who. How? The staff give the contestants everything they need to hide their identity. Clothes, hair, even wings. You mean... like a makeover? Like a makeover, but better. Come on, let's sign up! Today's the day, Pink. I'm sure you'll be the Academy's favorite. Tell me something I don't know, Ori. Oh, right. You know everything. I am so glad I'm your bestie. Help me with my makeup. I still want to look my best, even if I know I will win this. Ooh, should I prepare for the after party? Of course, Ori. Make sure everyone is invited, except for that commoner. <laughs> Like I'm awake inside of a dream You're getting closer Night's almost over I might just ask you to leave now with me Good evening, Fairyland! I'm your host, My Mic's Broken And this is the Royal Singer Face-Off! Many will audition tonight But only five will advance to the seven finals Please welcome our judges for tonight Fairyland Broadway Singer Christy Jane! Our next judge is a singer and songwriter, Tur Table! And last but certainly not least, 
Platinum Award winner and Male Artist of the Year. Are you single at the moment? <laughs> Please welcome <laughs> DJ! Let the Royal Singer Face Off begin! Up we have You'll Be Sorry. You say take me on a treasure hunt. When they sing and dance Oh, I wish it was me Every night When I close my eyes I see familiar. Are you an artist pranking us? Strange. I know I've heard that voice before. The votes are in. The five singers advancing to the semifinals are What? That no way I'm going to the semifinals? She's the crowd's favorite. Father, you have to do something! My daughter, don't tell me you're threatened by her. Whatever! You have to get that Noam girl out of this competition! I am not letting her steal my spotlight! I should be Dean Jay's opening act! Hmm... Next on the Royal Fairy Academy! Lady Nut, your baby. Your Majesty? I have an offer for you. You know that I'ma keep it cool With you I feel like breaking rules On the edge looking out with no parachute You know I'm dreaming about us too Playing around without a clue On the edge screening out With us it's all or nothing 